this on me, man. Yeah, that's what I feel. I'm sticky as fuck. Hey, what's up? It's Trey. We are in Algonquin Park, Canada, as you can see by all the snow and lack of people around us. And today, we are going to be making some weed maple syrup treats. We are going to need, of course, maple syrup, because that's kind of the whole point of this. Some cheesecloth, small to medium sized mason jar, about five grams of weed, a grinder, some popsicle sticks, candy thermometer, a little crock pot situation, and uh, a frying pan. The first thing we gotta do today is preheat the oven to 200 degrees because we are gonna decarboxylate the weed. So to get the weed ready, we go ahead and grind it. It was, oh, I guess we don't need a grinder for this, huh? I feel like, um, what, was, what was the Turkish dude's name when he was all like, Now it's time to decarboxylate it. The reason we decarboxylate is that without being heated up, many of the cannabinoids in marijuana aren't active yet. You're gonna wanna check in on it every once in a while just to make sure that it's not overly brown. You want it a golden brown, not like a doo-doo brown. The aroma. For this part, we're gonna need some cheesecloth. So you could use either just one piece and fold it over, or you could be wasteful and not give a fuck about the environment and just use two pieces. You know what the fuck it is around here. Put your cheesecloth down, now we're gonna go get the weed out the oven. Tying this all off into a little pouch. We are gonna put this in the jar right here, and then the next, next thing we're gonna do is get to some fucking infusing. You are just going to fill this up as much as you can. All right, that's good maple syrup. The crock pot comes into play. Put the top on. We gotta crank this all the way to low heat. And then you just let it sit in there submerge for about six hours or so. I'm gonna go stare out the window for six hours. But not in a weird way. This sweet, sweet uh, Canadian tree is not showing to the proper respect it deserves. Yeah, so. something to do it right. I'm a little high, I'm sorry. I actually fell asleep standing up at one point. What's up? Good morning, I'm back. I had a restful night of staring out into the abyss. It's time to take this out. It smells like weed and maple syrup. You can give it one more squeeze out if you want. And that is my weed infused maple syrup. So I get it in there. You got your candy thermometer, your pot, and you're just gonna get this boiling real quick. Yeah, so you wanna get this like, almost kinda like toffee caramel candy consistency. Otherwise it'll fall right through the snow and then like all these hours of work will have been for nothing. All right folks, we're there, 235. So one thing you gotta do is make sure it's nice and tight. And then, here's where the season is coming. I'm kind of like a salty, savory kind of guy. Just be careful you don't kill yourself with any like peppery stuff. And there's your weed infused maple syrup treats. It's like goddamn barefoot Contessa out here. Try it at home, be safe. Yeah, shout out to Canada, shout out to maple syrup.